Yo guys, what's up? It's your boy Matt Stroke back here again with another video guys and today finally Xavier has left me alone like I'm, I'm unscathed I know this Minecraft looking fool ain't talking about me What, what did you just say? Nah, nah fam, just, just... Get some close ups. Look at that. That's a dead body right there. So, anyway, like, if you're sad, don't be sad. <laughs> Alright, first of all, first of all, first of all, je ne suis pas d'accord, bruh. I am not okay. Things are not okay. Crikey. Good afternoon. That should tell you that. Me starting a vlog in the afternoon should tell you something, right? First issue, the first issue is that last night, right? I went to bed on a bowl of cereal, bruh. I ate cereal for dinner. <laughs> oh, you're understanding how bad it is, dude. My mom is probably watching this thinking like this, this fool. What, what, what's the problem, right? I'll tell you what the problem is, bruh. Uni is hard, bruh. <laughs> I'm smiling, but flip. No, no, no. Let's talk about this. Let's talk about this. Okay, you're probably wondering why did this fool eat cereal at about like 9 o'clock at night instead of eating a proper meal. So pretty much last week, my choice in food has just been horrendous. Like I have not been able to pick no more food because I've been, okay I won't lie, I haven't been like very keen to cook properly, you feel me? So like people going to uni, learn how to cook. I know how to cook, it's just that I've been a fool and I've been very lazy. I'm telling you right now, right, right now, this thing here is going to be your best friend. Like, don't be shy to cook, guys, when you come to university. That's the first thing, right? Don't be shy. And you know, the perception on this whole uni thing is that people always think that, like, if you come to university, right, things are going to be the same as home. Like, they're not, like, they really are not going to be the same. You know, I look back at it now and I remember when my mom was telling me Sorry, the door opened. I remember when my mom was telling me that, dude, you're gonna have to learn how to cook, you're gonna have to know how to do all your stuff. And I honestly didn't think that was a thing. I, honestly, in my mind, I'm like, you know what, it doesn't really matter. You're just gonna go there, you're gonna do whatever you want. But dude, I've just been seeing flames, bro. Like, especially with my diet now, I have to make sure that I'm eating stuff that's proper, bro. And honestly, right now, my diet has been a bit abysmal yeah pretty much it but i just came from the shops and i got some more groceries so proper groceries proper food so little fruits chicken oats stuff like that my main priority right now today is to get some more red bull before my next lecture so i've got another lecture in about an hour right and right now my red bull is gone like I'm telling you right now, Red Bull has been my best friend. Like, hey yo, hey yo, Red Bull. If you are, if you're watching the boy, you know, just support the boy and just like send over like 20 packs of Red Bull and I'll be fine. But honestly, just been operating on Red Bull fumes and don't forget to pray, guys. Like a lot of people, like what is it called? They disregard pray and like reading your Bible and stuff like that when you come to university or what, whatever you read. But read, guys, and just pray because. When you're by yourself this side, things can get nasty, but like real quick. So right now, I'm gonna head to the shops. I'm gonna get some Red Bull. I need to get some more paint for my next art class. I'm looking at the wrong screen. I'm not looking at the lens. Anyways, I'm gonna go get some Red Bull, then rush back and then go for my lecture. Then after my lecture, we've got some Judo. So that's gonna be pretty sick. Uh, uh, let me just put on my stuff and get out right now because if I wait longer, that's another thing dude like I've been doing like I've been doing uni like for the past three weeks I realized something about myself if I legit um decide that you know I have to go out and I and I sit 
and I sit on the thought of going out for more than two minutes, I'm not going to go out. Like I'm legit going to stay in my room and I'm not gonna go out anyway. It's like, it's so weird. So right now, I'm gonna head to the shop, get my Red Bull, get my paint, and come straight back for my lecture. Oh, I like the taste of it. So I just secured the paint, ah, uh, not the paint, the Red Bull. The other shop was too full, then the lines were like hella huge. So right now I just got my paint, I'm gonna head back. Paint, Red Bull, I'm gonna go back home. Dude, I almost fell on my face five times today. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just gonna go back inside and catch you guys. It's too noisy outside to vlog. Yeah, we got home with seven, wait, wait. Ah, uh, wait, wait. You know when you get a notification when money just goes out of your card and you're like, I didn't, I didn't pay for this. We got home, we got home with, ah, for, for, for focuses, with seven minutes, seven minutes to spare. Easy. I told you, we're clutch. We don't mess up, bruh. I'm gonna hit my lecture right now with the most confidence. Dude, I've almost fell on my face five times in the mall. You're... It's so embarrassing. Have you ever just like walked and just been like, anyways, let's go straight for the lecture now and hit that. out the lecture finally guys and yeah I'm gonna just go through my my groceries that I just bought but honestly guys buying your own groceries is a whole new experience like you think you know it until you go there and come back with Oreos bananas and fish for supper dude it's the worst, it's the worst thing but hey let me just walk you through what I got and what you should get pretty much so first of all I got myself some some deformed bread. I think it got squashed. Yeah. Chicken. Honestly, this is going to be my this is this will be your plug. Like just make sure that you get all your protein in. Make sure you're not getting anything that's like processed. Mince. Sweet potatoes. Honestly I like sweet potatoes because um what is it called? Normal potatoes just like taste so bland. So I would I would recommend sweet potatoes. Lebanon and Scottish oats. Thanks for watching this. I think that's it. Right now we're gonna make some sweet potato and mince, I think. Yeah. But now, as I've been saying guys, cooking is not my forte, so I'm gonna do my best to actually make something that's edible. Because honestly, it takes so much time to make a lot of this stuff. So today, only for today, I'm gonna to be using spaghetti carbonara, right? It's like already made, but I've got judo later, so I don't have time to actually like be cooking anything. So this is what I'm gonna be making with steak mints. Something easy, something light. So let's get straight into it. I keep on falling. We are finally done with the meal guys uh it's not a five star meal it kind of looks like something on a red to eat, like just a bit but 
pretty happy with it considering last week and yesterday I ate cereal for my dinner in the evening. Good improvement, improve every single day. And you know, the sweet potatoes, I would say sweet, sweet potatoes because I put some honey in there because you know, I, I like my, my, my food sweet. I know you're waiting for me to say uh, I like my, my ting sweet. Mm -mm. Leech, calm down. But yeah, gonna hit this meal, probably watch some Netflix, get ready for judo, and I'll show you that. So when I'm getting ready for judo, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit you guys up. So until then, I don't know why I just clapped. Anyways, it's an hour before judo training, and I'm actually gonna pack a lot of my stuff and get my stuff ready for tomorrow because my main thing this week, my main goal this week, is to plan way ahead, like way in advance. Because last week, I was so late for so many things because I was just like saying, okay, at seven o'clock, I'm gonna leave the house for 7.30. I end up leaving the house at like 7.25 when the campus is like, I don't know, like 15 minutes away from where I stay. It doesn't make sense. So now I've pretty much just been trying to what be on time. So it's like, we, we started like what, 8.30? And right now it's like what six times it? it's like what six o'clock now so get ready now stretch uh strap up get my strapping because my wrist is pretty busted eh? my wrist and my fingers I'll, I'll show you in a minute but yeah get my stuff ready pack some stuff clean up and pretty much get ready so let's go to the next i don't know future me they ask that question again what do you say with the the funny what the Michael Myers, what is it? Michael Myers or something like that? Who would win in a fight? Michael Myers or Jason Boyd? <sighs> See, Jason, Jason is a large own, like he's a big guy, dude. So obviously, you feel like he would have I more. Think, honestly, I think Jason would win. Doesn't Jason never die? Yeah, I think so. I haven't really watched. I haven't really picked. Does one never die? I think so. I haven't really like watched those movies, movies. I just know them from like Mortal Kombat and stuff like that. It's about drive, it's about power. We are hungry, we need to follow. <laughs> yes, you are pro. <laughs> this is what happens every day. I'll be doing something very productive. Like, I'll be doing something productive. This guy just called me with the most random stuff. Flip. Anyways, by him, I catch you, brother. Bitch. Bye. We are done taping up, um, sorry for the distraction, I hope you guys saw a good majority of that, but yeah, taped up, all ready to go, I'm gonna call my Uber now, and we're just gonna head straight for judo. Hey, if I don't show you guys too much, right, of the judo, it's like my first day training with like the British uh, national team guys, some guys are coming to a club from like the British na national team, so if I don't vlog like too much of it inside, like I'm, I'm just being serious, like I have to focus. Let's go. Yeah. Good. Yeah, I'm chilling, bro. A few moments later. So I've just finished the training session now. I got beat up, bro. Like, flipping if I had some leg. But yeah, my Uber's here. I'm gonna jump straight into the Uber and go home. Dude, I'm so beat up, bro. Like, flip, I'm so tired. But yeah, check you guys back home. My fingers, don't know if it's gonna focus. Fingers jacked up. Things are just. Yeah, my whole body is freaking sore. I can't feel anything pretty much, but I'm gonna tell you right now, right? I know where I want to go. I know what, where I want to be, and I know I'm gonna get there. And for anyone watching that feels that you shouldn't rip your set, like you shouldn't be out there and confident with what you want to do. Like real talk, if you have a dream, don't let anyone else say that that dream is invalid. If you want to say that I'm gonna do this and not just to yourself quietly in like a corner of a room saying I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. You can do that if you want, right? But if you just decide that, hey, now I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna I'm gonna say I'm I'm gonna say I'm gonna do this, right? In front of all these people, even if they think I'm crazy and I'm gonna sit down and I'm gonna do it and I'm gonna be strong about it. 
be strong right stop being scared of everything else that surround you it doesn't matter what matters is you and your goal and your focus don't let all this other stuff you see on instagram and all this other stuff weird fabricated stuff drive you away from what you really want if you've got your dream don't be afraid to say this is my dream if you're ever asked don't be afraid to say that this is what i'm gonna do not what I want to do, what I'm going to do. And I'm telling you right now, guys, as a man stroke fam, we're gonna do crazy things. When you have God on your side, nothing can stop you. Nothing, I'm telling you, nothing can stop you. Be strong with God and you will go places, guys. You don't have to be places to know that you can go amazing distances with God. Keep praying, guys. Keep believing in yourself. Keep just pushing forward even when it looks horrible just push forward trust me in the end it's going to be worth it right now you may not be where you want to be but it's going to be worth it and that's the end of the video guys thank you so much for watching like share subscribe matchstroke fam appreciate all the love and the support guys and with nothing else to say nothing else to say let's go all I wanna do is live it up with the homies Everybody really talking as if they know me But I guess I gotta face it